Okay, this how-to video is going to talk about glossing inside the Cadence PCB tools. Um, so this is level dependent, obviously depending on the software that you have. So if you have an Orca Professional or an Allegro PCB Designer license, under the root menu you're going to get a gloss menu and then you can obviously do things like add teardrops, add tapered traces. There's a full parameters option so we can look at things like LAR and via cleanup some line smoothing, some via eliminate, depending on really what you want to run, there's, a, there's a, even a, a convert corner to arc. Um, if we look at something simple like a line smoothing option, what we can do is we can, so let's go and run the line smoothing option, we can look at the specific options. So go and remove things like bubbles and jogs and dangling lines. If you look, I've got obviously got a couple of uh, routing issues where maybe I've, I've, I've just been a bit extravagant the way I've routed the tracking, or I've got a funny little corner here. So what we'll do is we'll just leave the defaults as they are, click OK, and then gloss the boards. And very quickly you can see obviously things like this get straightened out and sorted out from a glossing point of view. If we go file change editor and we go down to the Orca PCB standard license, some of the more advanced options are gone, but under the root we still get the gloss line parameters so we can do a basic line cleanup like we've just done now um, previously, but some of the, the, the more advanced glossing features you would need to the higher level tools to be able to do this.